Welcome to Squim Real Estate Questions and Answers. I'm your favorite buyer's agent in sunny Squim, Washington, and I'm going to show you today how to find out which irrigation district a property is located within, if, in fact, the property is part of an irrigation district. Of course, water now is more precious than gold, so if you're um, buying property in the Squim area and you're fortunate enough to have access to irrigation water from May 1st to September 1st, you are very, very fortunate indeed. This is a fantastic map, and I'm gonna show you exactly how to find this map. The first thing you're gonna do is pull up a Google search and you're gonna type in Squim Irrigation Districts. Right here, number three, it says Squim Irrigation Districts. That's an article I wrote. Uh, you'll want to go to that. Now, depending on what day or week or month you search in Google, this could be up here in number one or two or three or four. But just look for this article, Squim Real Estate Blog, entitled Squim Irrigation Districts. Now, here's the article on my blog, Squim Irrigation Districts, How to Find Out if a Property Has Irrigation Rights. You'll want to read this article, and I've got several resources in here for you that you're going to like. Uh, there are several maps online that show you uh, the irrigation districts. Here's one. Dungeness Valley Irrigation District Company Boundaries. Here's another one. Squim Valley Irrigation Piping. And here's my favorite. This is the one I, I think you should look at because it's more detailed and it actually shows quite a few roads and highways by name so you can track down the approximate location of a property and then use the legend over here to identify which district that property is located in. Okay? You'll be able to use this article to do that and there's plenty here to read. Uh, if you go down to this map, there's that map I just showed you. Here is a link below that map that will open that map up and you can enlarge it, zoom in to the area you want to. And then there's more information, more help for you. There's even a landowner's guide here. If you click on that, that will take you to this wonderful site, which is a landowner's guide to Washington water rights. A uh, very, very helpful uh, pamphlet. It's 48 pages long with lots of good information. If you have any questions about Squim Irrigation Districts and you're buying property in the Squim area, you can always reach out to me. Uh, a couple of uh, little notes for you here is irrigation districts here, there are seven of them, and they're all run informally by the property owners in the area. So, for example, we have the Klein Irrigation District, the Dungeness Irrigation Group, Clallam Ditch Company, Dungeness Irrigation District, Squim Prairie, Tri Irrigation Association, Agnew Irrigation District, and Highland Irrigation District. Each of these charges a fee, and sometimes, depending on the district, there may be a fee when you buy the property, a transfer fee from one owner to the other for the uh, water rights. And then there's an annual fee, for example, in my area, uh, I only pay $60 a year to have unlimited uh, water access from May 1st to September 1st. And so it's a pretty good deal. If you need water outside and you want an irrigation district, you'll want to look for that when you're looking for property or acreage. I hope this is helpful. And you can always reach out to me if you're looking for a home on some acreage with an irrigation district. You can reach me at 360-775-5424, and one of the best ways to reach me is just to text me at that phone number. All right, hope this has been helpful. Have a great day.